You put a lot of time and effort into customizing your vocabulary file in the TouchChat app, so you'll want to make sure you back it up regularly. You will need to export the vocabulary file from your TouchChat app through one of the following options. AirDrop, Email, OneDrive Storage, Google Drive Storage, Dropbox, iTunes, or an iShare subscription. Let's start with AirDrop. You will need to have the second iOS device nearby in order to do this. Start by going to Vocab, then choose New Vocab. Go to Menu, then click on Import Export Vocab. We want to export and share. Find the file you want to export, change the name if you'd like, and tap on Done. Select AirDrop as your method. It will search for a nearby device. Select that device. On your second device, you will need to accept this AirDrop. It will ask where you want to import it in. Select Touch Chat. It will ask if you want to import this into your Touch Chat app. Say yes. Rename it if you would like. Then tap on Save. Your file is now available on the second device. Tap on Done to finish the export. Now let's look at exporting by email. You will need to have an email account set up on your device in order to export the file from TouchChat. Go to Vocab, then choose New Vocab. Go to Menu, then click on Import Export Vocab. We want to export and share. Find the file that you want to export. Change the name if you would like, then tap on Done. Select the email icon. Enter the email address you want to send the file to. Tap on the blue circle to send the email. You can also export vocabulary files to several cloud-based storage sites, including OneDrive, Google Drive, and Dropbox. Go to Vocab, then choose New Vocab. Go to Menu, then click on Import Export Vocab. We want to export and share. Find the file that you want to export, then tap on Done. Swipe over to find the icon for the storage app you want to use. Select it. You can select a folder in the drive and then select Upload. Your export is complete. You can export vocabulary files using iTunes file sharing on the PC computer. Export the vocabulary file from TouchChat by going to Vocab, then choose New Vocab. Go to Menu, then click on Import Export Vocab. Select Export to iTunes. Find the file that you want to export, change the name if you would like, then tap on Save. Now connect your iPad to your PC computer with iTunes using a USB cable. Open iTunes on your computer. You should see your iPad on the left column and the device icon near the top. Click on the icon and select File Sharing. Find the Touch Chat app icon and click on it. Find the name of your vocabulary file and click on that. Scroll down to the bottom and click on Save. Choose where you want to save the file to and click on Save again. Finally, you can pay to use the iShare server to store your backed up vocabulary files. iShare gives your TouchChat device access to a large server where you have a private section that only you can access stored personal vocabulary files. There is an individual and a team subscription option. You can trial iShare free for one year.
You can register for an account from the Touch Chat app or by going to the iShare Services website. After you create an account, go to Vocab, then choose New Vocab. Go to Menu, then iShare Service, the first time you will need to log in. Next, tap on My Files. Select the folder where you want to store your file, then tap on the plus sign to add your vocabulary file. Rename the file if you would like, then tap on Upload. Tap on OK. Your export is complete. You can find more great resources on the TouchChat website. Go to www.touchchatapp.com. You can also learn more about TouchChat and implementing AAC at aaclearningjourney.com.